I'm David Bumpus, sales manager at Outdoor Living RV, and I'm here to show you this, the 2017 Sport Trek 190 VTH toy hauler. This has a lot of amenities that you're really going to appreciate. It works great as a toy hauler, but it's also a great camper. So let's get right into it. First, I want to tell you, this is a great South Texas trailer. All the framing on the underneath is powder coated and epoxy coated, so you don't have to worry about rust. All the lights on the exterior are LED. It has a great 3,500 pound power tongue jack. If you come around to this side, you'll see it has ample storage with a pass through all the way across. You're gonna see how deep that is. You got a beautiful power awning. You just press the button, it comes all the way out. And if you'll notice, it has LED all the way across it. So you can have a nice uh, camping area, even at night. If you'll notice, this also has a nice big grab bar, so it's easy to get in and out of the camper. Um, the, as the door shuts, you've got a nice uh, screen door so you can have air come in and out. Uh, all the windows have uh, screens on them as well so you can have a nice breeze when you're camping, whether it's at the beach or whether it's at the river or whether it's at the lake. This will be a great camper for you. As you keep coming around, you'll see it has nice aluminum rims. Again, those won't rust as well, just like the frame. Nice and sturdy. And what you don't see is on the inside, this is a nice, durable, welded aluminum frame as well. If you come around, come around to this side, you're going to see um, this also has uh, vents so that when you do use this as a toy hauler, you'll see ramjet air vents on the top and the bottom of inside the bay area. That way you don't build up fumes. It's a nice, sturdy deck, and uh, it's very large. That way when you do drive up something in here, it's not going to bottom out at the top here. Okay? It has a nice transition deck piece here and a nice transition deck piece at the top so that you get in here, you don't have to have the big bumps nice and tall. It does have a nice uh, screen so that, you, again, you can use this uh, as a camping area and not have to worry about the bugs getting in. You just bring your little toy outside and then this becomes all nice, livable, usable space. It's got a 15,000 BT air conditioner. Not many toy haulers like this do. Again, at less than 20 feet long, most of them will give you an 11 or, or maybe a 13.5 AC, but not Sport Trek. They're going to give you a nice 15,000 BTU air conditioner. Double insulation on the roof, insulated floor, fully sealed underbelly, so you don't have to worry about the rust underneath there. You don't have to worry about bugs getting in there, any kind of infestation like that. The roof being all vinyl, stay nice and bright white, so you don't have to fight that uh, sun coming in. It'll bounce the heat right off, that way the AC stays nice and cool in here. What you don't notice here, what you might uh, want to see is this this deck here, in this part right here, is over nine feet long. So you can get a pretty good sized bike in here, an ATV in here, and still, when you take it out, you can drop the couch down, make a bed out of it as well. Um, nice entertainment package. Uh, this, this stereo is an AM, FM, CD, DVD, Bluetooth stereo. So if you want to sync it to your phone and get maybe iHeartRadio or Pandora or something like that, you can listen to your tunes inside or outside. They're both on separate channels, so if you want to listen to the music outside and not bring it inside, you can still do that. The other thing that's really neat about this is you can use this as a, as a sitting area, but you can also use it as your dinette. So when this drops down and makes the, makes the booth table, or excuse me, the, the bench, you've also got a nice table right here. It's a trestle-style table. You can open it up, drop it down right here, or what's neat about it is you can actually take the table outside. It has all the kitchen that you need, plenty of cabinets, a nice bank of drawers, and all the drawers are uh, plywood with real hardwood fronts and stainless steel ball bearing drawer guides. So again, uh, you don't have to worry about the corrosion or anything like that as well. You got a stove, an oven, and a microwave, so you got the type of cooking that you need whatsoever. Okay. You also have a large gas electric fridge. This isn't those little ponies. This is actually a good size gas electric fridge, and it'll work as you're going down the road, so that by the time you get to the coast. This will be nice and, and chilly cold and frozen at the top, and it'll still be cold for all your sodas and things on the, in, on the inside. You still have extra storage, just so you know. You do have a furnace as well, and it'll also heat that underbelly. So if at, at any opportunity you might have ice or snow on the ground, still heat the underbelly and make sure that the, uh, make sure that the uh, pipes do not freeze. Uh, you know the 190 VTH, again, like I said, it's a really good camper, not just a toy hauler. A lot of times you see toy haulers that act like a garage with just a bed in it. So it's a glorified garage, real camper. So you, uh, again, you have the nice entertainment area. As you come back this way, you're going to see you have a really good, well-appointed bathroom. You have a, a sink 
a, a commode and a shower, full size, a nice uh, power vent um, so that you can keep this thing uh, ventilated when you're taking a shower and maybe getting a lot of steam in there. Give you a pan around to the other side, good storage, a nice pantry cabinet from the kitchen area. This is the main door. Um, it'll have a fire extinguisher as well and three steps. Most of them just have one or two. So it's easy to get in and out of this thing. And if you pivot on around, you'll see a queen size bed. You don't see that very much, much in these little campers. Plus, that is, this is a cotton cloud mattress, so it's a really good mattress. All of your switches are hidden. You, you have the awning, which is electric. You have lights for the awning and the, all the individual lights as far as inside and outside. And they didn't forget to give you all these cabinets over here, too. If you look down here uh, at the end of the bed, you also have a plug so that you can put uh, CPAP or plug your phones in, things like that. Um, what, you, what you don't see underneath here is, remember I was talking to you about the aluminum framing? This also has a real marine grade plywood subfloor instead of using particle board. That way you don't worry about the humidity um, making the floor soft, especially around the front threshold area or your main traffic areas or in front of the, sh the commode shower area. You don't have to worry about that because this is a durable trailer. Again, the exterior sidewalls are extremely durable. The floor is durable. The wall, the roof is walkable, um, being an all solidly enclosed structure with fiberglass on the exterior instead of aluminum means you have you worry a lot less about leaks, things like that, up to things like hail. Um, you'll you'll get a lot of good camping experiences out of this without a lot of maintenance. One of the best campers I have. Uh, the 190 VTH Sport Trek toy hauler is very versatile in a lot of ways. Uh, they also allow you to take the TV and bring it outside. There's a mount behind here. If you want to put a mount on here, you've got cable access and you've got a power cord so that you can put a TV outside under your awning. You'll also notice here, these are the largest jacks they make um, for this type of trailer. Uh, it's a very sturdy jack, same kind of jack you use to lift up your truck. Uh, that makes it really, really stable, not just when you're towing something in it or, or you're dropping it out with something in there, but when you're inside it, you don't want it to be all wobbly, okay? So if you come around this side, I'm going to show you a few more things that make this a great camper, not just a great toy hauler. If you look right up here, you're going to see they allow you, and they put the backing for it and the 12-volt wiring for it if you want to put a, uh, a camera back here so that you can uh, back up and, and, and do that safely. It is an add-on, but it's something we can do very easily right here at Outdoor Living RV. Coming around this side, you'll notice that all the windows in the, uh, in the Sport Trek 190 toy hauler are safety glass, tempered safety glass windows, and they're 90% UV and inverter tinted windows. So that'll help keep the sun uh, from baking the inside of the trailer as well. Got that big AC, you got the vinyl roof, you got the fiberglass sides, and now you got the deep tinted windows that will help you as well. If you keep on coming around, you're going to see that they've got a, a nice brush aluminum, aluminum guard around the wheels. That'll protect the debris from scra scraping the uh, outside of your coach. Keep it nice and clean, easy to use. You'll notice here that this is prepped for solar as well. So if you want to go off the grid, maybe go out to a little secluded area, a beach or a lake or something like that, you want to use solar to. Uh, Keep the battery charged up, that way all your 12 volt systems work. You just plug it in right here, you don't have to do any extra wiring or anything. You do have a nice outdoor shower. Again, sand, dirt, mud, if you're cleaning tackle, if you're cleaning uh, game, things like that. This is perfect for that because you've got hot and cold running water. One of the things this doesn't show you is, this also has a sewer tank flush uh, mechanism. Which means that when you're ready to dump after the end of the trip, and you're ready to, to get rid of the waste, you can, you can spray the inside of that black tank out with nice cold running water and it'll rinse that thing out like a dishwasher. That way you have a nice clean tank, maybe a nice clean uh, hose when you're done, nice clean area. That way the trailer doesn't smell like a porta potty when you're ready to use it again. Come around here to this front side, again you're going to see a beautiful pass-through storage. You can get to it from either side. Uh, you can put all sorts of gear in here, uh, all your collapsible tables, your collapsible chairs outside rugs, um, anything that you need to do, need to use that's, uh, that might be slightly dirty, you can put in right in here. That way you keep it away from all the clean and stuff that's inside of the camper. All in all, this camper is a very, very well-designed camper. Aluminum structure, all vacuum on it, super durable, super sturdy. 
that epoxy coated powder coated frame, one of the best in the industry. It makes that box nice and sturdy and durable. This trailer is going to last a long time and you'll love it. Great amenities and I want you to come see us at Outdoor Living to see this and all the other sport treks that we have to offer. Uh, the 190 VTH Sport Trek toy hauler is very versatile in a lot of ways. Uh, they also allow you to take the TV and bring it outside. There's a mount behind here. If you want to put a mount on here, you've got cable access and you've got a power cord so that you can put a TV outside under your awning. You'll also notice here, these are the largest jacks they make um, for this type of trailer. Uh, it's a very sturdy jack, same kind of jack you use to lift up your truck. Uh, that makes it really, really stable, not just when you're towing something in it or, or you're dropping it out with something in there, but when you're inside it, you don't want it to be all wobbly, okay? So if you come around this side, I'm going to show you a few more things that make this a great camper, not just a great toy hauler. If you look right up here, you're going to see they allow you, and they put the backing for it and the 12-volt wiring for it if you want to put a, uh, a camera back here so that you can uh, back up and, and, and do that safely. It is an add-on, but it's something we can do very easily right here at Outdoor Living. Coming around this side, you'll notice that all the windows in the, uh, in the Sport Trek 190 toy hauler are safety glass, tempered safety glass windows, and they're 90% UV inhibitor tinted windows. So that'll help keep the sun uh, from baking the inside of the trailer as well. You've got that big AC, you got the vinyl roof, you got the fiberglass sides, and now you got the deep tinted windows that will help you as well. If you keep on coming around, you're going to see that they've got a, a nice brush aluminum, aluminum guard around the wheels. That'll protect the debris from scra scraping the uh, outside of your coach. Keep it nice and clean, easy to use. You'll notice here that this is prepped for solar as well. So if you want to go off the grid, maybe go out to a little secluded area, a beach or a lake or something like that, you want to use solar to uh, keep the battery charged up. That way all your 12-volt systems work. You just plug it in right here. You don't have to do any extra wiring or anything. You do have a nice outdoor shower. Again, sand, dirt, mud. If you're cleaning tackle, if you're cleaning uh, game, things like that, this is perfect for that because you've got hot and cold running water. One of the things this doesn't show you is this also has a sewer tank flush uh, mechanism, which means that when you're ready to dump after the end of the trip and you're ready to, to get rid of the waste, you can, you can spray it, you know, the inside of that black tank out with nice cold running water and it'll rinse that thing out like a dishwasher. That way you have a nice clean tank, maybe a nice clean uh, hose when you're done, nice clean area. That way the trailer doesn't smell like a porta potty when you're ready to use it again. Come around here to this front side. Again, you're going to see a beautiful pass-through storage. You can get to it from either side. Uh, you can put all sorts of gear in here. Uh, all your collapsible tables, your collapsible chairs, outside rugs, um, anything that you need to do, need to use that's, uh, that might be slightly dirty, you can put in right in here. That way you keep it away from all the cleaning and stuff that's inside of the camera. All in all, this camper is a very, very well-designed camper. Aluminum structure, all vacuum on it, super durable, super sturdy. That epoxy-coated, powder-coated frame, one of the best in the industry. It makes that box nice and sturdy and durable. This trailer is going to last a long time, and you'll love it. Great amenities, and I want you to come see us at Outdoor Living to see this and all the other sport tricks that we have to offer.